A huge ban wave is going on in CS2 right now and this is the biggest ban wave since CS2 released and I'm saying real because I'm obviously excluding the fake ban wave that happened in early December where thousands of innocent players got banned. No, this one is actually real and it looks like one of the most popular cheat providers for CS2 was targeted by an update that Valve did to their anti-cheat. So the amount of cheaters gone is absolutely huge. But before we go into that, this video was sponsored by Skins Monkey, which is an automated CS2 trading website where you can trade your old skins for some new ones instantly. And if you use my code OSNI on the website, you get a 35% deposit bonus and up to $5 balance for absolutely free and because it's Christmas Skins Monkey has prepared a free gift for everyone watching this video in which you can get a completely free skin deposit bonus or free balance and for each $10 you trade on the website you can open another free gift on top of that they are running an advent calendar where you can get another free gift every single day which include tickets that you can use to join giveaways check out Skins Monkey below so gay follower who is a very trusted source posted this on December 19. Devs at Counter-Strike are working on a new system to prevent suspicious hits. This is most likely a new method that will trigger when bad actors are detected. In other words, this is a way to combat cheaters but he posted something new today. Looks like we will see the first results of this update today. The first noticeable ban wave happened a few hours ago and is still going. So according to him, this update Valve was working on is responsible for this new ban wave and it looks like one of the most popular cheat providers for CS2 was hit. This screenshot is from a forum of these cheat providers and as you can see there's dozens of people complaining that they got caught in this new ban wave. There's no official numbers for how many people got banned but I'm predicting it is going to be huge. Just so you have an idea, this cheating forum has over 500,000 registered players, which is absolutely insane. You can already start to see how big the damage of this ban wave is. Many people in the premier leaderboard got banned and even the number one player in the world in the leaderboard shared a screenshot showing that he got hit by this ban wave. And if you actually go to the in-game leaderboard, you can see that there's a huge amount of positions not showing. As you can see the number 1 is not showing and the number 3 is not showing for example. Many of these don't show because their name was not approved but that is just a small part of why there's so many numbers missing. So out of the top 500, about half of them have been banned in this new VAC ban wave and that is why their names are not showing up in the leaderboard. That is actually huge. Players are also sharing screenshots from Lidify and CS2 stats showing that a big amount of their matches had cheaters banned today. So it looks like Valve isn't completely sleeping after all and the fact that one of the biggest cheats for CS2 no longer works is very good and in the short term premier matches should have less cheaters overall. But this does not solve the big problem after all, this new update mostly combats rage cheaters and if you don't know these are the ones that are basically shooting and aimbotting behind walls and doing very obvious stuff like bunny hopping through the entire map and to be honest these should have been instantly detected and banned by VacLife in the middle of the match and not in a ban wave a few days or weeks after they actually started cheating. But I am no expert when it comes to cheats so hopefully this is a start of Valve actually getting some control over the cheating problem in CS2. Let me know what you guys think about this down in the comments. If you guys enjoyed make sure you leave a like and subscribe to the channel for daily CS2 videos.